Somebody look at your neighbor and say, she finna bring it tonight. I said, somebody look at your neighbor and say, she finna bring it tonight. Well, we gonna jump right into it because that's how we do it over here. Check it out. I've been getting so many emails, positive feedback. I'm happy because you happy that you finally open up your eyes to get this shit. I need that you are the musicians. You are the magicians. Okay? You got the power. Okay? You got to overstand that. You really got the power. See, I got to teach y'all how to use the mojo bags and different shit like that. Because we don't really know how to use the full potential of our mind to attract what we really want. Oh, that's another video right there. I said, so, so, come to bring it. Playtime is motherfucking over. Check it out. I've been getting so many emails, positive feedbacks on everything. I'm glad y'all happy. Okay? But I got some people they want to know. They said, could you break this spiritual bath down to me? I want to really understand that. I want to really understand it. I said, okay, well, I'm going to teach you how to overstand it. What is a cleansing bath? What is a spiritual bath? What would what, what that mean? Taking a ritual bath and spiritual baths? Could you break it down? I'm going to break it down tonight. Taking a ritual bath is the form of a spiritual cleansing that can clear your aura of negative energy and lift your spiritual motherfucker vibrations. I said I'm breaking it down tonight. Listen, you must understand that a ritual bath with a little bit of water, prayer, herbs, all that shit that ass can wash away any unspiritual stinkness of the motherfucking body and leave you purified and cleansed. Look at your neighbor say, don't you want to be purified and cleansed? I know I do. Check it out. People ask me, so, so, madam, what is a, a spiritual aura? Because I, I see that you you get on your page on the price list and stuff like that. You you, you talk about the, the aura, the aura bath cleansing. Could you break it down? I said, I'm going to break it down. Check it out. Spiritual aura. Aura bath cleansing. What is aura cleansing? What is an aura cleansing bath? Now, coming to teach y'all on this day. Your aura is your energetic body. Okay? Your energetic story. The accumulation of all them, them negative, nasty ass thoughts. Those ideas, y'all know what I'm talking about. Those beliefs, Christianity, religion, period. All that other shit, period. Beliefs, beliefs and feelings about the world and how you fit in about yourself. That's what the aura is. Okay? So without releasing and protecting and cleansing yourself, you create more obstacles in your life. Look at your neighbor and say, you create more obstacles in your life. I said I'm breaking it down tonight. I need to overstand this. I'm trying to teach people. I'm teaching y'all how to be free. You have to cleanse your motherfucker body. Wash that spiritual ass. Check it out. You ever see somebody? They get out of Christianity. They get out of religion, period. And they start learning knowledge on how to free their motherfucking self. And then guess what? They end up right on back to the same shit. Why? Because they ain't cleanse they aura. They ain't cleanse they aura. Okay? That old brainwashing shit, they ain't cleansed it off their ass. That old way of thinking, they ain't cleansed it off their ass. That's why it keep coming back to haunt they motherfucking ass. Because they ain't been cleansed. Look at your neighbor and say cleanse your motherfucking spiritual body. Clean your spiritual ass. Check it out. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Y'all know what I'm talking about. That go for any religion. What words you see in the word religion? Rely on. Y'all see the shit in there. Religion. Rely on. You better overstand the play on these words. And, you, and, and I gotta say this. I seen a comment and it really, it did something to me. Okay. Cause I'm sensitive as well. Okay. I didn't know that people was taking, I wasn't talking at you. Okay. I was talking to you to overstand. 
and I seen a comment and say, oh, she just screaming at us. Uh-uh, you, 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 you're not overstanding me. I'm not screaming at you. That's because you're you not feeling me. You're not, you're not on my same, you ain't on that level, okay? You ain't on that vibe. The people who, who get this, they understand that I'm trying to teach them. And when you teach somebody, you don't just talk to them my sweet like that. You talk like you want them to overstand some shit for fucking real. Hello, somebody. Okay? So if you was offended by that, I apologize for your offendency. Okay? I try to keep it a little more better. Think about a crack user. They get clean for about seven months or something. And want to go back to the crack. Look at your neighbor and say, why? Because they need to cleanse that motherfucking aura. They need to cleanse that old thought pattern. They don't need no crack. Okay? They got to cleanse that motherfucking thought pattern. That old way of thinking. Said I'm going to bring it tonight. Said I'm going to bring it. And whenever you get this message in the morning, at night, in the evening. So, so, madame, coming to bring it. Check it. Now think about it. You wash your fleshly ass, don't you? I said you wash your fleshly ass, don't you? So why not wash your spiritual body? Why not wash your spiritual ass? Look at your neighbor and say, why not wash your spiritual ass? People laugh. <laughs> That's crazy shit now, bitch. That's why no motherfucker body don't want to be around your ass. That's why you keep going to these motherfucking interviews and your ass can't motherfucking get the job. Because you need to be cleansed. Bitch, check it out. Talking to the motherfuckers who like to laugh. Say stuff stupid. Well, you can sit the back, sit the fuck back and look stupid all you want to. And I'm going to go for something that's going to work for me. Hello, somebody. Hello, Wood. Hello, Pews. Hello, Chairs. Say, so can I get a witness up in this bitch tonight? Huh, check it out. You wash your, fl your fleshly ass, you got to wash your spiritual ass. And somebody around you with a not so pleasant smell, you want to leave. Make you want to throw up. You want to leave because you can't take the smell. It's overbearing. I, I wouldn't even want nobody to be around me if my ass is not washed properly. If my ass is not washed, period. If my ass is not washed, I don't even want to be around nobody. I might look at your neighbor and say, wash your spiritual ass. Check it out. If you don't wash your spiritual ass, you start attracting low vibrations. Folks ain't going to want to be around you. Talking about your shit start becoming to be a little bit off. Okay? That's why you got to wash that ass. Now, most folks, shit. Check it out. They don't, they don't even they don't even think about their home. They don't think about their house. Shit, you got to cleanse your home too with the negative energy that come in and out on a motherfucking daily. You got people walking in your house with their shoes. They done walked all over the motherfucking streets with and shit. People lay tricks every day outside. And you step in and bring it in right in your motherfucking house. Laying the trick. What, what is laying the trick? Somebody lay some shit down. And they want you to step in it. Because when you step in it, woe unto your ass. Whatever they put on your ass is bound to be done. That's what laying tricks is. And they lay it outside most of the times. Where somebody can walk over it. And you step in bringing that shit in your house. You better cleanse your house. Shit. Now, now, now you must understand this too. A cleansing bath ain't just taking no soap and just saying a scripture. You got to know the proper ingredients to put in these baths to activate the motherfucking cleansing energy. Okay, check this out. The way that I got these ingredients for this cleansing baths, I had a dream. And when I awoke from that dream, I tell y'all, honey, I'm a dreamer. I'm a dreamer. Ancestors speak to me with dreams and, and things of that nature. I'm a dreamer. That's my shit. Check it out. And honey, when I had them dreams, I, I woke up. And when I sleep, I, I make sure that I have a pen and a notepad on my bed. Because I don't want to miss this information that's coming down for the motherfucker ethers. Okay? I can't miss this shit. So I, I keep that on my bed. And when I woke up, 
I wrote the ingredients and everything down that I seen in a dream to do. And I used this bath and it worked for me great. I got another sister. Like I said, I got emails from so many people. So one sister told me, she said, oh my God. Girl, after that bath, I felt so motherfucker relieved. Ha! I said, that's what it is. You got the motherfucking power. Look at your neighbor and say, wash your spiritual ass. You got the motherfucking power. Okay? Work it. Work it. Shit. Jesus' ass wasn't in that motherfucking Bible just doing all these ritual type shit. Using all these herbs. Go look it up. Jesus was using herbs. It was using herbs in the Old Testament. Do I need to bring it again? Huh? I guess not. Because I have to fuck these Yahweh fuckers the fuck up trying to come for me. Shit. So, so mad. Damn. Don't play around. Bitch, if you don't want to hear what's going around in the motherfucking palace, then stay the fuck out of our shit. Huh? I said I'm going to bring it tonight. So in a dream, I saw the shit, wrote it down, and I took the bath, and I'm talking about, whew, that motherfucker was powerful. Powerful. That's all I'm going to say. I ain't got to sell my shit. I know what I do. Look at your neighbor and say, wash that spiritual ass. I said, look at your neighbor and say, you better wash that spiritual ass. Check it out. Most people, they don't even know this. With your homes, like I was saying, it's certain ingredients that you mix together to cleanse your home to attract in these different things and bring out different things. Okay? You want to attract love? You can clean, do a house cleansing and attract love. You want money? You can do a house cleansing to attract money. See, I ain't know this. I said, so, so, madame, coming to bring this shit tonight. Because I brings it. The shit that you ain't know. I will come break the fucker down. That cleanses for all types of shit. Check it out. Now I'm going to say this because I'm going to end it real quick. Another thing people need to know is, you know, some people, they doing certain rituals and spells and shit. And they ain't seeing no, feel, no full results. That's because they dirty. That's because they dirty. I said that's because they dirty. They need to be cleansed. They need that spiritual bath cleansing. Half of the people been hexed. Look at your neighbor and say, you better cleanse your spiritual body. Then you can attract. Then your attraction becomes king. Then your, your attraction becomes queen. For my females. Okay? Can't put no clean clothes on no dirty ass body. What do I mean by that? You can't be attracting everything that you really, really want when you dirty in the motherfucker. You got to be cleansed. Huh? Baptism. Huh, yeah, right. Give me some herbs, some water. I'll show you how to do a cleanse. Ah, oh, I told y'all. I had so many people they go to the church can't even be cleansed from, from different shit. Took them to the water to get cleansed. And the shit was broke. I told y'all, oh, I'm about to get into some deep shit coming for y'all. I got some shit coming for my people. Shit, I love y'all asses. That's how we do it over here. Check it out. You can only lead the black horse to the water, okay? But you can't make him drink. Maybe his ass just want a motherfucking apple. Catch that. Okay, now if y'all interested, y'all just email me. It ain't for everybody. Everybody don't believe in things like this. and it, it, It's not going to strike to everybody that's okay. But I'm here for my the people that I'm here for, okay? The people that I got to be helping at this time, a time such as this. Okay, so if you're interested, email me. And I do charge for consultants on spiritual baths and other rituals. Y'all email me. You know, we'll send you a list of what I got. You know, so you make a choice. It's up to you. Okay, I'll teach y'all, show y'all what it is, how it is, how it work. And if that's what you want, hey, that's what you get. I got people coming at me about these Goetia seals. Hey, if that's what you want to work with, I will show you how to activate it and how to do it. Because what you do at the end of the day, you be your own magician. This is your life. Don't let a motherfucker tell you what to do or what not to do. You just got to know how to work with the motherfucking energy. That's why I'm here, to consult this motherfucking shit. Hello, somebody. I'm going to end it right here. Y'all email me at RuthCaprice at gmail.com. R-U-T-H. This is all lowercase. R-U-T-H-C-A-P-R-I-S-E at gmail.com roofcaprice at gmail.com and team so so we'll get y'all together 
Okay, I'm, I'm seeing your messages. They give it to me. You know, if it's personally for me, I read your messages and I'm, I'm trying to respond to everybody. You know, the best that I can. But I'm going to leave it right here. And honey, we'll be back throughout the day. Today.